guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl precious oyibike i'm a nigerian youtuber i film about faith relationship and lifestyle yeah it's a new year it is 2021 it's a beautiful year and i know this year has great things in stock for us please be expectant trust god put god in all you do in the course of this year now in today's video i'm going to be talking about how to draft out your goals how to draft out your plans and good ideas i mean good goals ideas or you know areas in which you need to write your goals and your plans for in 2021 so we can have a superb and beautiful 2021 so the very first thing i'm going to say is that you need to take stock of the things that happened in 2020 okay how far thus far what have i done what do i need to do okay where do i need to adjust you know you need to begin to take stock of the things you need to do take stock about 2020 went okay your health how was your health in 2020 how was your spiritual life in 2020 how was your financial life in 2020 how was your career with your business how was your relationship to your family in 2020 all these things you know you invite it out to be like oh in my family okay i really tried today but my finance my savings was low, my investment was low, I don't really get more cash inflow in 2020. What do I need to do? What do I need to do? So it will help you to re strategize, it's help you to, you know, to direct your efforts into the areas that really need those efforts. So take stock of how 2020 went. It's not still too late to take stock of how 2020 went. So have a superb 2021. I know when we started this year, we all had to like, oh, 2021 is my year of natural this. 2021 is my year of this. 2021 is 2021 is my year of advancement. 2021, I'm moving forward. 2021, everything, everybody, body gave 2021 a name. Some people gave 20. I gave 2021, 2021 my year of congratulations. That was the name I gave 2021. But if I really want to receive congratulations on you and then I have to put in the necessary work and necessary effort to make 2021 that superb year that I want. Another thing you need to do is that you need to write out your goals and your plans for 2021. What are your goals? And you need to focus your goals on seven areas. The first area is your health. And it's not in, I forgot to quote, it's not, it's not in a particular order or in any other. Your health, your spiritual life, your um, career, your business, your personal development, personal development. And um, what's the last thing your finance? If you can take it, and if I'm not really sure, I'm going to list it out in the comment section so you guys can know the actual, you know, the goals areas you need to focus your goals on. But you need to write, okay, if I else, in my else, what do I need to do in 2021? Okay, I want to reduce my abdominal fat. Which food inflow should I reduce? Which areas should I should I start doing exercise every morning for 30 minutes or for 15 minutes? That will be called. No, it's all about consistency. So achieve your goal, you need to be consistent to what you need to do. So your health for finance or how much do I need to save? Okay, I'm only I already have one source of income. What do I need to do? Should I me have a side also? Should I start another that source of income? Should I look for a way of generating another source of income? At the part of things you need to check to have a better finance life in 2021. Another area is your spirituals. No. I, I believe every year we should all desire to get close to God more, to have a deeper relationship with God every year. Like last, this year should be better than last year. That is what I trust God for. I know 2020 for me was super spiritually, but I expect 2021 to be much more better. Like I think my work with God in this year to be much more better, even than my expectation. So, and my watch for this year is God is able to do exceedingly abundantly above what I ask of or think. So spiritually, I know God is able to do exceedingly abundantly above what I ask for. That means in 2021, I have a deeper work with God. And for me to have a deeper work with God, I need to come and um, put in more hours into study the word of God, put in more hours into praying, put in more hours, much hours into showing for the fruit of the Spirit in me, the fruit of the Spirit, which is love, patience, perseverance, long-suffering, and the likes, and love, and the likes. So... All those things need to come in place to have a superb 2021 for my spirituals for my personal development okay what do i need to do to develop myself in 2021 okay how many books do i need to read how many videos should i watch per week how many books should i read per week or per day how many seminars am i going to go how many trainings will i need to attend that will make me better because the greatest form of investment is personal development your personal development is your greatest form of investment you know career um 
developing yourself in your health is good developing yourself all these things is the one that entails in your personal development because if you get your personal development right it will affect all other areas of your life it will influence your health it will influence the way you relate to your family because you would have come across a book that said oh you need to keep a time your family life and you put in more effort because you have know some books and practical books that help you in knowing what to do to help yourself in your families, at yourself in your relationship life, in your marital life, name it. So write out your goals. And your goals need to be specific. I'm going to put a picture on the screen or it might cover the entire screen. Your goal needs to be specific. It needs to be smart. You need to set smart goals. And S starts for specific. Your goals need to be specific. In 2021, don't say I want to have good money flow. Write I have three million naira in my account by october 1 2021 that is a specific goal if you are saying i have so so i have millions of money in my account millions of money is what i ask when someone is like oh i can do it i can do anything i'm like doing anything is doing nothing be specific tell me what exactly you can do tell me what how exactly you're going to make how ex how much exactly you're going to make so be specific in 2021 Concerning your goals, concerning your health, okay, I'm going to take one bottle of drink per day. Don't increase it to two. Don't increase it to three. If it's one bottle of drink, then it's one bottle of drink. If it's one, if it's only take I am one fruit every day, take one fruit every day. Be specific. I will take one fruit every day. I mean, taking one fruit every day means I have to put in the money. The money for the fruits, you also have to talk about, you also have to sort that out in your goal. Like 2021, we have to be specific because we want to make millions of millions in this year. Not only millions. Uh, we can be like Elon, Elon Musk and make billions. I mean, the latest billionaire. Who, who does not want to be the latest billionaire? No one of the richest men in it. You, you get what I'm trying to say. And that thing is that your, goal, your goals have to be measurable. Measurable in the sense that you have to measure it with time. You know, everything is related to time. See, your goals have to be measurable. Your goals have to be achievable if your goals are not achievable then why 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 i you know some people like building castles in the air like like oh i would have reached so so so, so level by 2021 and you're like even the person writing that goals knows that that goal particular goal cannot be achievable if you plan to write a book this year don't say you, you know personally that you can only write like two books maximum this year you're not writer, i'm going to write 50 books this year Except the only goes fall upon you. You yourself, you know, personally, I cannot write fifty books. So don't, 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 don't build castle in the air. Set an achievable goal, goal that you can work with. That even if it not meets the target, you can stretch yourself to the next target. And that thing is that your goal have to be reliable. In twenty twenty one, set realistic goals. Set realistic goals. Don't just set any kind of goals. Let your goals be realistic. And the last thing is that your goals have to be time bound. You have to set your, your goals to time T. You know, any goal that's not, that can't be selected to any time, to any time limit, then I know normally our brain works in such a way that if you time yourself and do something, you tend to achieve that thing more than when you do not put any time limits to it. Like, for example, okay, I time to record two videos per week. If I know you call that video per week, then you know, I, if, I, if I just say, oh, I plan to record two videos per week. Recording two videos per week means that I can record less than two videos. I can record more than two videos. I can choose not to record any video at all. If I say I record two videos every Wednesday, you see, come watch me on Wednesday. I will make all that time to record that video. As long as Nigeria electricity <laughs> is working with me. You get what I'm trying to say? If you're living in Nigeria, that's what I'm, what I'm talking about. So please set achievable and realistic goal in 2020. Let your goal be time bound. Don't just set goals because everybody is setting goals. Set goal because that goal work in line for you. Not because your friends set this as well kind of goal. So you feel it resonates with you. So you feel this goal is my kind of goal. So let me also set that goal. Mm -mm. Please, in this year, be intentional about your finances. Be intentional about your investments. What medium is bringing money into your pocket? You know, be ready to stretch yourself. Stretch yourself. I imagine everybody like an elastic band. You know, imagine an elastic, an elastic band reach a particular point. And when it stretches on a particular point, that it might want to break free. So stretch yourself. You will not break. Hard work does not kill a person. Only hard life does. So be um, and not only hard work smart work does not kill a person 
only add light girls. So please be intentional. Be intentional about how you're going to make your goals happen. And every time, always cost check. Okay, how far have I gone in my goals? How far have I gone? You always ask yourself, how far thus far? Always ask yourself that question. And if you have watched this video to this point and you have not subscribed to my channel, what are you waiting for? You cannot just enjoy this content for free. I know you've come across my channel before, so please watch my videos, subscribe to my channel, and don't just watch for two minutes. Watch for five, ten, watch, watch everything. Yes, it's not a crime to watch everything.